Okay, I received this ECU to test it on the bench because on the car um, many sensor won't work. Uh, it has a lot of uh, errors about uh, crankshaft sensor, camshaft sensor, EGR, wheel rail pressure, manifold air temperature sensor, manifold air pressure sensor, mass air flow and so on and uh, they suspect this ECU is uh, shorted out at uh, 5 volt reference line or lines and I need to check it before they will go on on the measurements okay this is the ECU I need to connect to the pin out and this is the pin out. Okay. Here we have 12, 12 volt line. Ground. Terminal 15. Four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and we have can low and can high. This is enough to power it on the bench and to connect it by diagnostic tool I have here the VCDS and the multimeter let me put it so you can see something okay the ground probe from the multimeter is connected to the ground case of this ECU. Let me put something under the connector. Okay, this is the wiring diagram for this type of ECU, for this engine code specific. And the problems that customer tells me they, uh, they struggle with is this camshaft position sensor, crankshaft position sensor, and many, many other sensors like the wheel rail pressure sensor and other critical sensors for the engine I need to test this pin A35 A51 A57 and I think that's it for the moment okay I want to power up this ECU and uh, to measure all the 5 volt lines okay let's power the unit and I'm gonna test the first pin that is A57 A57 60 59 58 57 we have 5 volts that is perfect next a 35 31 32 33 34 35 but but this should be zero volts and yes we have zero this is the ground and i'm gonna put my probe here on the 12 volt line and measure again and yes, we have ground. It's perfect. Let's continue. 
Five volts. Five volts. Five volts. Five volts. What I want to do is to apply some consumer. I want to apply a consumer like a power probe to see if the voltage drops. So here we here we go. Okay, something's wrong. Okay. Let's try now. Sixty, fifty-nine, fifty-eight, fifty-seven, five volts. And you can see as I'm applying the power probe, the voltage drops just zero point zero one volts. So we have four point nine nine. Okay, so the issue is good. They must have a problem with the wiring or a, a shorted sensor. That's why I wanted to test uh, with a consumer and the, and the 5 volt line remained at uh, around uh, 5 volts, 499 to be specific. And that's it. Okay, so they must um, go on with the measurements. It's very hard to to measure a short circuit when you have uh, common lines, common uh, reference voltage lines. So it must be a problem with the wiring or um, one or two or many sh uh, shorted sensors. So it's a um, complicated uh, procedure, but it needs to be done. Okay, thank you for watching. Let's go and work on something else.